James, tell me about the Tito Puente series that's going on here tonight. All right, the Tito Puente series is a fantastic collaboration between the City of Boston Park Arts program, Inquilinos Bericos Nexion, La Casa de la Cultura, and Berkeley College of Music. We started about three years ago, and it's been really my favorite project. It's been one of the most fantastic collaborations we could have dreamt of. And what is the significance of doing it here at the Casa de la Cultura and at OJ Park? Right. It was, it was originally devised really as a community building project. The city of Boston, thanks to Mayor Tom Manino, came through and decided to redesign the park, remodel the park here. And so we really designed it as, as a park opening where the three organizations could come together, put some, you know, each bring our own area specialty and open the park back up to the community. Why is this such your, your favorite event? I love it because what it really does is it, it joins communities where people from the South End can come together, people from all over the city can come together, come down to see Via Victoria, La Casa de la Cultura, which I think is really one of the most important cultural resources we have in the city of Boston. Berkeley can come into the community and it's really just a wonderful example of organizations of higher education, municipal organizations and community-based nonprofits coming together and doing what they do best. Great. Well, the Boston Latino TV team is looking forward to additional concerts this year and in the future. Thank you so much for your time, James. I appreciate the opportunity. Thank you.